Miracle Mile night, and it is always a lot of fun to be winning these feature races. Diane Riley joins me after the win of Sicario. Firstly, welcome and congratulations. Thank you very much, Paul. Lovely to be here and lovely to finally interview me. We've been, we've been threatening about this for a little while, haven't we? I know, but it's finally happening and it's one of those things that had to happen. Did You're a celebrity though now. I've got to take a number, don't I? Is that how it works? No, not really. No, no. I, I want to promote harness racing for the young people, you know. Just keep dreaming and um, buying horses. Go to the sales. Tomorrow they're on. Look at you go. You're doing my job. Well, that's all right. That's all right. Hey. I, I'm open. I need the money. I need the money, actually. <laughs> One thing I do want to say, though, Di, we've got Denise and oh, now I need the gentleman's name as well. Bruce. Bruce. Bruce is only half in, though. We've got to try and get Bruce in there. Now we're right. Um, harness racing horses is fun, isn't it? Oh, it is. You know, um, I like owning, owning horses myself, but... I also enjoy being with other people, you know, like the fun we've had tonight and people generally are happy for us, you know. So I encourage people to get into syndicates, go to the sales tomorrow and, and buy a horse and share the joy. Denise, did you think you were going to win tonight? Like, are they, I, I can be honest, I haven't seen the race, unfortunately. I was in, doing an interview at the time. But he came from a long way back with a bursting finish. Did you think he could actually win? Well, no, we didn't think he'd win um, at the start of the race. But then we realised what Cameron was going to do. So, yes. What, can you explain the thrill once he once he hits the line? Like, on a big night like tonight, when there is such a big crowd, we've just seen a brilliant mirror. And while you follow up afterwards, it's just a great night to be a part of, aren't they? Oh, it is, yeah. You get the shakes and then you start screaming and you think, oh, my God, everyone's listening, but you still scream. Yeah, it's wonderful to see them over the line. And it's a, it's a special night to win on, aren't they, Bruce, these nights? They're the nights that we all like to win and be involved in. Miracle Mile, Inter Dominion, all those big nights that we all dream about winning those races. But it's a great thrill and it's a thrill hard to replicate uh, any winning any race, but on a special night, it's extra, extra, extra thrill. I'm lucky enough I get to travel around a little bit, and I, I run into this lady from time to time <laughs> at the odd spots. Exactly what you want to say, though, like we travel to New Zealand, we, we get people need to come and experience these, and how much fun they are, don't they, Di? Well, actually, you've fallen on your feet because <laughs> I started watching you a few years ago, and I thought, what's this fellow going to do? And next thing, he's jet-setting all around the world. And I thought, well, hang on, this is good. This is good. And I'm enjoying watching you. you great job, um, Paul. I, I was more going to give us just a pl harness racing a plug. You don't have to look after me. I love being around you. I love having fun. And that's the one thing I, I reckon you do do, Di. You, you, uh, you, you have people, you captivate people around you. So I think it's great. And I, I want people to enjoy harness racing the way that I do. Well, that's right. That's right. Well, we're going to Club Menangle. So <laughs> heaven knows what will happen after that. Then we'll go to the sales. And then, um, look, I'm not going to go in away for the next... This is my last journey for a little while. I've been down to Melbourne... Sydney the last three weekends and listen I'm, I'm, I'm just about out of fuel. <laughs> Sales are at uh, the Gold Coast next uh, weekend. Know, you know. I, I'll, I'll get home and I'll go to the um, Gawana Bar, um, uh, Bar retreat where they detox you and revitalise you so next Sunday if any of you guys are out there at the Sales you'll say oh god Diane's revived. <laughs> Diane, Bruce, Denise, thank you. Well done. I'm going to interview you more often. You've, you've been holding it out on me. These are more fun. You know that, don't you? <laughs> Jessica, no. Jessica's watching this now, and she's thinking, oh, I shouldn't have done this. She organised it for us, didn't she? No, yes, she did. But listen, make sure that everybody knows I'm not a cougar. With, when I'm with, <laughs> like, I've got all these young guys around me. They're beautiful. But you love it, don't you? Oh, I do. I do. I love them. Okay. We'll see you at the sales tomorrow. See you, Di. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>